I'm Dr. Mark Gilladov, Chairman of the Department of Thoracic and Cardiovascular Surgery at the Cleveland Clinic. At Cleveland Clinic, we have completed more than 10,000 mitral valve repairs for people with mitral valve prolapse. In the last 4,000 cases, we've had 100% survival and a repair rate of more than 99%. Mitral valve repair is a complex cardiac surgical procedure. However, like any complex task or operation, breaking it down into understandable pieces leads to success. But first, the big picture for mitral valve surgery in degenerative disease, and degenerative disease means prolapse. Those two terms are synonymous. The big picture is that when we operate in people who have mitral valve prolapse, we must be able to repair nearly 100% of those valves, and we must do it and can do it at an extraordinarily low surgical risk. When someone presents with mitral valve prolapse that causes severe mitral regurgitation, there are two possible operations. To the left, mitral valve repair. To the right, mitral valve replacement. Mitral valve repair is the better choice. We know this from studies that we at the Cleveland Clinic and others have done over the years. When we compare valve repair to valve replacement in patients with degenerative disease, we find that people who receive valve repair live longer, meaning a mitral valve repair for prolapse restores you, the patient, to a normal life expectancy. This is why mitral valve repair is so important. It is a complicated procedure, but we have developed an easier approach to the Cleveland Clinic born of our more than 10,000 operations.